Hello friends, this is Durga again from IT Varsity and uh, as part of uh, Amazon Web Services, I am showing how to set up uh, uh, AWS command line interface and as part of that I have already covered introduction and also how to set up on uh, Windows and this is the add-on video for the setting up uh, uh, AWS command line interface using Mac. So if you want to know more details about uh, AWS command line interface, uh, you can actually go to my playlist, Amazon Web Services, and uh, you can see this video for the introduction of AWS CLI. Uh, and if you are using Windows, you can go through this video and uh, use Sigwin to install it to install AWS command line interface. In this, I will be covering how we can do it using Mac. So we would like to install on terminal. And uh, we would like to see whether pip is already there. It's not there. And I, I would like to see about Python version. It is using 2.7.10. And if you want to install Python and if it is not available on your Mac, either you, you have to use Mac ports or you can directly go to the Python website and download it. And when you actually go to python.org and download it, it will typically come with pip. If not, you have to set up pip as we have done in Sigwin. For that, I am going to Google and searching for the, uh, Amazon command line interface. Click on this and we want to install pip, click on pip and then uh, install pip and copy this one, means download this one to your system, save file, click ok, it is already downloaded. And now you can go to CD downloads here and then run python get pip.py. I have to do using sudo because I don't have whatever user I am using to run this does not have administrator privileges so I have to sudo which will run this command as root and hit enter. It will prompt for your uh, admin uh, root password and you have to type it correct. And once that is done, it will install pip on your Mac. So it is done. Now you can actually do pip install AWS CLI. Again, you have to run using sudo hit enter and you have the uh, AWS CLI on your Mac you can validate by running command AWS it is complaining that it's too few arguments and you can actually do AWS uh, EC2 describe instances and see if it returns so I have to run uh, AWS configure so that I can actually configure region and uh, from then onwards I can actually run the commands. So being said that we have the AWS command line interface uh, on, on our Mac also. And also as we, uh, if you are using Windows uh, I have covered in another video you can watch it. Once you have this you can write your shell scripts wrapping around uh, the AWS commands which we will see down the line and automate the process of creating the servers, processing the data and terminate the cluster or servers once the processing is done to leverage pay as you go model of AWS so that your operational costs of, um, uh, of implementing your business applications uh, can go down significantly, especially for batch processing of data and several other use cases. That being said, I hope you are enjoying the content on my channel. If you like the video, please click on the like button. 
if you have feedback or ask want to ask any technical question please leave it in the comment section of the video and if you have not subscribed to my channel yet please do so you will see a lot more content on my channel and covering vast array of topics over time thank you bye